Behind a 14-0 run early in the second half and some late game free throws, Stony Brook squeaked by Binghamton 62-57 on Wednesday night to advance to the America East semifinals. The game was a shootout early, with Binghamton knocking down five of its first six shots and Stony Brook keeping pace with a couple of threes. Both teams were in double digits by the 14-minute mark, but the game settled down as both teams' defenses began to clamp down. Jameel Warney attempted just four shots in the first half, heading into the break with three points. To make matters worse, his frontcourt partner Rayshon McGrew was forced to sit with two fouls midway through the period. Stony Brook missed 12 straight field goals during one stretch and shot just 30.8% from the field in the first half. Binghamton took advantage, heading into the halftime break with a 25-23 lead and the rebounding advantage. The second half looked like a carbon copy of the first until the Seawolves went on a 14-0 run which included a Scott King 3 and alley-oop slam. SBU's defense was at its peak form throughout the second period, forcing 10 Binghamton turnovers. Stony Brook cannot pull away though, holding on to a shallow 6 point lead with just over 5 minutes to play. Warney came up with a couple of huge late game assists and knocked down two game ceiling free throws to close out the contest. Stony Brook will head to Vermont to face off against the Catamounts on Sunday, March 8th at 1pm.